Here's another quick tip to use the camera on your phone in quilting. Anytime you're laying out pieces, whether for a block or for a whole quilt top, then taking a picture and looking at it is a great way to get a different perspective and a check. But something else that you can do is after you've taken your picture, edit it so that it becomes a black and white picture. And this will really show you where there's clumps grouped together of dark and light and where the contrast is. That gives a totally different look than the original colored picture. So don't forget to also look at something in black and white, especially if you're trying to find balance between the light and dark parts. My name is Elizabeth and this is Evita Studio where I help you make beautiful things with quilting, pojagi, and embroidery. Thank you.